Just wanted to give you a quick update. I know we haven't posted in a while um, on some changes we did on the back room of the second floor. I used to run a, oh, I do run a podcast out of that. I used to have a nice big room um, to do my podcast, grittyhour.com. Um, but now I've squeezed it into this back room here, and that's our storage area. And we moved these counters around in the back here from probably the last time I showed you this back room. This is a M and K, and nice butcher block here, by the way. Beautiful oak table, a buffet server, a river table, which I'm just learning about now. This technique, I don't know how old or new it is, but these river tables are pretty cool. I have a dealer that just brought one in. Very well done. I love the wood. I love the. Not sure of the technique behind it. I'll have to learn more as I go. But he's done. He's done these little cutting board here. There's another piece here which is sort of like wall decor. Um, but I'm I'm digging it. So this dealer just moved some stuff around and they brought some new stuff in. This is M and K, uh, previously known as Layla's Antiques, Michelle and Keith. So if you do come up and uh, check out their stuff, I, I think you'll find them very interesting. But the reason we did this remodel of the second floor, this this part here, all these things I'm showing you, used to be cordoned off. And um, that's where we kept our storage and I did my podcast from there. So I squeezed all that into the back so we could make room for Portmanteau, which is a brand new dealer in the shop. Uh, two gentlemen, John and Eric. They live right here in Millbrook, so they're local dealers, and they're just getting into the antique business. This is their first foray, and I just wanted you to show you some of what they did. They painted the wall, which is a plus for us. Looks really nice. So they put a lot of work into the preparation of this booth, and they just uh, moved in here. And uh, they have some pretty substantial nice things here. I'll just give you a quick brief uh, walk around their booth to show you some of the stuff they initially brought in as stuff sells they'll be bringing more in they've been they've been uh, collecting antiques for quite some time um, I'm not sure how I feel about it because they were regular customers here now they're dealers hope that doesn't curtail their buying here <laughs> there's a beautiful floor lamp Nice wall mirror, a lot of nice paintings, really nice paintings. That's an oil on canvas, signed by M. Johnson, really nice piece. Some uh, culture, nice floor lamp. These, these wall sconces are nice too, these wall lamps. So really nice stuff. And what they have a lot of, initially, is uh, these jackets. They're all made in Europe. Really nice. This one's from the uh, this one's made in Germany from the 1970s. Beautiful jacket. Obviously, high quality jackets. They have a whole rack of them here. I'll show you some of them without getting myself showing myself in the mirror. But I just wanted to show you some of the stuff. Very cool jackets. I think there are there is a market for collecting these things, and um, if you stop in their booth, you'll see some some really nice collection of uh, of jackets. So come on down to the store and check out our newest dealer. They're as I said, right on the second floor in the back room. Um, I think I had shown you uh, George and Gil and and Elizabeth. Um, Liz O'Connor, a photographer. You probably have heard of her if you're from the Millbrook area. So I've shown you their booth and uh, they're doing very well here, I'm happy to say. A lot of militaria. And Portmanteau, John and Eric, who's our newest dealers, just coming into the store and we're very happy to have them here. So come on by and check them out when you get a chance. Thank you.